प्रणाम आचार्य जी सर सर मेरा सवाल है जो हमारे दिमाग में कांस्टेंट उथल पुथल चल रही है सर वी स्टूडेंट्स ऑफ एज 18 टू 22 सर वी हैव सर्टेन गोल्स फिक्स इन आर लाइफ वी हैव मेड बाय देम सेल्व और बाय आर पेरेंट्स एंड वी नीड टू अचीव देम मतलब वी थिंक लाइक दिस बट सर सर देन देर इज इमोशनल ब्रेक डाउन देर इज कॉन्स्टेंट के ऑस इन आर माइंड मतलब इन पर्टिकुलरली आई एम टॉकिंग अबाउट माई सेल्फ देर आर सो मच थिंग्स दैट आर गोइंग इन साइड माइंड दैट we can't really focus on a single on a single task at a particular time sir how to overcome that overthinking and i know that we have to do i have to do certain things but that the perception perception of time fades away there is so much of overthinking all the time sir you fail at accomplishing a particular task in a given time which particular task which particular task remember the one sitting within is very stubborn that one is thirsty and desirous and there is one deep desire ha huh? if you involve yourself in fulfilling other desires or doing other things attempting other tasks the one within will not cooperate you will fail and that's when people say oh i can't concentrate i can't concentrate i ask them on what first of all are you concentrating on the right thing are you concentrating on the right thing imagine a kid you have with yours little kid ha huh? the kid is thirsty the kid is thirsty and you take the kid to a toy shop and you think that the toy is quite important at least for the kid will the kid be able to concentrate even in a toy shop will the kid be able to concentrate no concentration the kid is thirsty you are not taking him to a stationery shop you are saying you will get the best kind of pencil and eraser and tell me the fanciest notebook i'll give to you and it's important to buy these things because the teacher has asked for them will the kid be able to concentrate the kid is thirsty and you are so ignorant you do not realize the one fundamental thing you first of all need to give to the kid it's neither toys nor sweets nor stationery not clothes not entertainment nothing the kid is sitting inside you the kid is thirsty do you realize its thirst it is that thirst that expresses itself in lack of concentration see what you really want and then there will be no need to practice concentration otherwise concentration will remain a lifelong problem the ones who are into real things never need to concentrate concentration just comes to them running a begging the ones who are into unreal things keep trying to concentrate and still fail the mind is distracted and running in 40 other directions ha huh? you need to value the right desire you need to put your time where your real value is on one hand you think for example that studies are just a way to secure placements then what is it that you are putting value on placements now how will you concentrate on studies tell me you have already taught yourself to value money how will you value academics now your mind will go where your values are and what do you want to do with money you want to entertain yourself right i'll roam the world i'll visit all kinds of scenic places and next to you is your mobile phone and scenes from those places are being flashed on the mobile screen now would you ever want to concentrate 
on your studies if the ultimate value lies in entertainment and that's what you are studying for so that you may get placed and then earn money and then entertain yourself then the mind says if entertainment is the final and highest value why not have entertainment right now so close the book and jump into entertainment and that's what we experience all the time do we even know what to desire that's the question that's the question and that's called crisis of values we do not really know what is desirable we do not know what to put value on you put value on one thing and you try to give your time to something else obviously you'll be bored distracted energyless hmm in business parlance they say put your money where your mouth is right invest where you believe in do what you profess tell me honestly if today you are told that you can have great placements even without studying and you can have your degree with 9.5 cgpa without studying honestly please tell me who would not agree who would not agree and that's the reason why in the hinterlands such shops actually do exist you enroll you pay money and you then don't need to be in the campus they'll courier you your degree you don't even need to come for the convocation they are happy that's also now you would understand the thing behind cheating in examinations because the whole process the value that you put on is not learning the process is not about learning the process is about securing marks so if marks can be secured by copying rather than learning pretty fine no concentration is a problem because we live loveless lives when you love something i am asking you do you face concentration issues <clears throat> huh no whatever you value you find yourself concentrated there and if you cannot concentrate at the right places then you have to question your values ever faced a problem of concentration sitting in the cinema hall who has faced such a problem nobody nobody comes and says but sir you know i cannot concentrate on this song and dance sequence then you are you have a laser like focus you'll burn the screen with your sight is concentration a problem then having the right desire is the problem having the right values is the problem concentration is not a problem i keep a huge note of a huge huge bundle of currency notes here who will face problems in concentrating not on me on that immediately you will concentrate i put up a collage of very exciting pics for youngsters over here who will not concentrate who will not concentrate immediately you'll concentrate you'll concentrate so much you'll forget everything else and then you say you have concentration problems no the crisis is of values we do not know what is important when we do not know what is important rather we have taken all kinds of nonsensical things as important things that have zero value we have imbibed them as valuable 
question your values write down all the things that you take as important and then objectively with all your brain power ask yourself are these things really important that's something that you need to do right now in your life once you are 25 you might find it's too late there are so many things that you get irretrievably into the process is one way irreversible reaction right now is the opportunity when you should decide what really is important in life and if you can see that you won't need to ever concentrate again if you don't see that you will bear the consequences all your life because you will get into all kinds of wrong stuff and many of those things you will never be able to extract yourself from once you have gone in you will remain in won't be possible to change tracks you know what i'm talking of right